Hi, I'm Erica from Farm Steady, and today we're making bagels from scratch. Most people don't even realize you can make bagels in your kitchen. Here in Brooklyn, bagels just show up by the dozen, often in a brown paper bag with a tub of cream cheese on the side. And when that happens, everyone gathers around and digs in. Friends, family, coworkers, everyone loves the person that brought the bagels. But homemade bagels? That's a new level. What people don't realize is how easy it actually is. So let's get started and make some bagels. You're going to need a few kitchen supplies, a food processor, baking sheet, baking mat, pastry brush, and a large slotted spoon or spider to get the bagels out. In the kit, we have an instruction card that led you to this video, your cheesecloth, and vegetable rennet. If you haven't started on your cream cheese, you're going to want to go ahead and watch that video first. The cream cheese needs to strain overnight, so you'll want to start that the night before. For the everything bagels, we have baking yeast, everything spice mix, malt syrup, and the everything bagel mix. Let's get started. In your food processor, you want to combine your baking mix and yeast. Put the cover on and get ready to stream 12 ounces of hot water straight from the tap spine through the top. Now let it run for two to three minutes until the dough forms into an elastic ball. When the dough's formed into an elastic ball, you're going to want to set it aside to let it rise for 45 minutes. You can do this in a greased mixing bowl covered with a clean kitchen towel, or if it's a warm day, you can do it right on the kitchen counter with just a little bit of flour laid down. After 45 minutes, your dough should have nearly doubled in size. Take your dough and divide it into 12 balls for your bagel. You're going to take each ball and roll it out like a snake. Loop it around your hand and tuck the edges together so that it forms a bagel shape. And repeat for all 12. When you've formed all 12, you want to cover them up and get your water boiling. When your water is at a boil, it's time to add the malt syrup. Now it's time to boil the bagels. You'll want to do one at a time, and you're only going to boil it for a minute, 30 seconds per side put it carefully in the water. Once your bagels are boiled, you're going to brush them with an egg wash and top with the everything spice. And we have bagels. We did it, we made bagels. For more great kits for DIY food, garden, and farming projects, check out farmsteady.com.
Ha, 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 ha.